Humidifiers are a fantastic accessory to have in your room because they keep you nice and hydrated and they can help fight off some pesky congestion. But how do they work? What's up world, it's Tony, the sleep accessories editor for Mattress Clarity, and as such, I am perfectly qualified to help explain how humidifiers work. So let's get started. Before I get started, I do need to mention that Mattress Clarity does get sent products for us to test out for free. And if you use any of the affiliate links we have in the description box below to make a purchase, we may earn a commission from that. This helps fund our operation and keeps our content free for you guys. These days, there are two main types of humidifiers. You have warm mist and cool mist humidifiers. Now, truth be told, there's not much of a difference when you look at the benefits of either using a warm mist humidifier or a cool mist humidifier, because when you think about it, the mist is gonna be room temperature by the time you breathe it in, so it just boils down to your personal preference. However, if you're sensitive to sounds while you sleep, a warm mist humidifier might be better to go with because they're often quieter than cool mist humidifiers. Warm mist humidifiers work by taking the water in the water tank and sending it to a central heating unit within the base. This then heats up the water and turns it into steam, hence warm mist. Now some warm mist humidifiers will have the option to include a liquid inhalant or vapor supplement to help you really fight off some extra congestion. Because after all, that's the name of the game when using a humidifier. Now we have cool mist humidifiers. True to the name, there's no heating element within the base of the humidifier, but you'll often see cool mist humidifiers be called ultrasonic humidifiers. And that's because there's a component within the base that will produce ultrasonic vibrations, which is what turns the water into a vapor. Like warm mist humidifiers, some cool mist humidifiers do have the option to add a liquid inhalant or vapor to really fight congestion. Humidifiers go beyond keeping your airways nice and hydrated. They also keep your room at an optimal humidity level. Experts agree that keeping your room at around 40 to 60% humidity is the ideal humidity level. So this is great information if you live in a more dry climate. Some humidifiers will constantly keep going though and won't shut off once you've reached that humidity level, but that's why we have smart humidifiers. Smart humidifiers have a built-in sensor that will shut off when you've reached that optimal humidity level. This is great if you live in a more wet or humid climate so you don't have to keep the humidifier always going. Now let's talk about some benefits of having a humidifier in your room. Starting off, as I've said throughout this video, they keep your airways nice and hydrated. Now this just means your body can more efficiently deal with congestion by clearing it and keeping your airways nice and open. They're also a great option if you're dealing with some dry skin, so they'll keep your skin nice and hydrated. And because you're feeling nice and hydrated and your airways are open, they can also help with snoring too. If you want some of my favorite humidifiers, I've got a list of the best humidifiers in the description box below. Hopefully this video helped demystify, see what I did there, humidifiers for you and you learned a thing or two about how they work. If you want to read more about humidifiers or mattresses, bedding, and more, you can find it at mattressclarity.com. I'll see you next time. Bye.